Welcome into the Monday, July 5th edition of WHKY TV News. I'm Rob Eastwood filling in for Ralph Mangum. Fentress Fountain will fill in for Ralph on the crime report a little later on in the broadcast. Ralph will return tomorrow night. Fentress also has the weather forecast and Jason Savage has local sports, including Hickory Crawdads developments from over the weekend. In addition, at the end of the broadcast, we'll hear from Lindsay Lewis, who has the latest from the Catawba County Library System. Topping our news tonight, a maiden man was sentenced to a minimum 13 years in prison in a sex offense case that dates back to April of 2019. 54 year old Daniel Ray Harris of Donnie Harris Lane in Maiden was sentenced to 156 to 248 months in prison or 13 years to 20 years, eight months behind bars. Last Monday, Harris pleaded guilty to felony attempted first degree statutory sexual offense, felony child abuse involving a sexual act and felony indecent liberties with a child. The victim was known by the suspect. As WHKY reported in January of 2020, Harris was indicted that month on charges of felony first degree kidnapping, felony sexual activity by a substitute parent, and felony child abuse involving a sex act. Harris was originally arrested April 23rd of 2019 when he was charged with statutory rape and indecent liberties with a minor. After his arrest in Lincoln County, the Randolph County Sheriff's Office charged him with felony statutory rape for a related case. In addition to the active prison term, Judge James W. Morgan of Cleveland County sentenced Harris to a suspended sentence of 16 to 29 months, which goes into effect when Harris is released from prison. Well, the unemployment numbers for the state and the Hickory Metro were released last week. It was a mixed bag in the Hickory Metro. Most of the counties in North Carolina saw their jobless rates increase. Here in the Hickory Metro, Catawba County's unemployment rate is 4.3%. That is the May unemployment rate, and it is unchanged from April's report. Alexander County's jobless rate fell to 3.9% from April to May. That was down from 42 in the last update. Burke County saw its unemployment rate rise to 4.2% from 4% even in April. Caldwell County's jobless rate increased to 4.6% from 4.5. The unemployment rate for the Hickory Lenore Morganton Metropolitan Statistical Area or MSA is 4.3%, the same figure reported in April. Hickory Lenore Morganton is tied for the fifth lowest unemployment rate among 15 MSAs in the state. The statewide unemployment rate stands at 4.5% according to the May update. That's up from 4.4. Unemployment rates increased in 77 of North Carolina's 100 counties in May, decreased in 8 and remained unchanged in 15. Scotland County has the highest unemployment rate in the state at 8.6% and Orange County has the lowest at 33 